Hill News. We're your hosts, Trinity Hughes, Michaela Jones, and Anna Robertson. Happy National Dip, Deep Dish Pizza Day. For today's lunch is turkey and cheese hoagie, baked chips or sun chips, romaine salad, vegetarian beans, baby carrots and ranch, cookies, fruit, and milk of choice. Now on to, the, to today's weather. Thank you, Anna. Now for today's weather. Today is Friday. The current temperature is 58 degrees. The high for today is 74 and the low is 57. The, we're going to have morning showers and that's a 30% chance. Uh, so the sunset's going to be at 7 9 p.m. and the moon phase is a new moon. For Saturday, the high is going to be 80 and the low is going to be 61. It's going to be partly cloudy. The sunrise is going to be at 6.26 a.m. And sunset's going to be at 7.10 p.m. The moon phase is a waxing crescent. Now, Tara. Thank you, Jalen. Sunday, the high and low of 6, 79 and 60. So there's going to be scattered showers. And the sunrise at 6.25 a.m. And sunset at 6.10 p.m. The moon phase is going to be a waxing crescent. Now, on to Senior Spot. Thank you, Tara. For Senior Spotlight, we have Logan Boggs. First question is, what is your plan after high school? Um, after high school, I'm going to be attending Shorter University, majoring in biochemistry. And hopefully after that, I'm going to do my graduate school at UAB and be a dentist. Um, what is the most creative excuse you've ever made to get out of homework or work? Uh, I usually just say I have to go work on the yearbook and I go to Ms. Harding's room and talk to her. <laughs> what is your favorite moment that you've had in high school? Uh, well, I've had a lot of good times in high school, but it's probably going to be graduating, so I never have to come back here again. Um, what will you miss most? Uh, definitely seeing all my friends every day and playing sports. Okay, thank you. Cool. Now back to the news. Catherine Lukdich reports from Orange Beach, Alabama, on the latest of the case of Lauren Sizemore, who was found in Alabama after missing for almost a week. Now on to Teacher of the Week. Thank you, Michaela. Now for Teacher of the Week. Today we have Ms. Barkley. How does it feel to be a Teacher of the Week? I am so surprised, shocked. I was not expecting this, so it feels really great. How long have you been at work? This is my second year. I was in kindergarten last year. This is my first um, year in fourth grade. What, what do you like about Lincoln High School? I like that it's a big family. Um, I can go to anyone in any grade level and talk to them about anything. I have many friends here that have helped me so much, and I just I really love being at Woodville. Will you be here next year as like a full-time teacher? I hope so. I really hope so, because I really love Woodville, and this just feels like my home. You can't see. Now, back to the next. Thank you, Cheyenne. Police say two men were found shot, death, shot to death inside a car in Fairfield. Police said there were, there were are persons of interest, but no arrests have been made. Two bodies were found in Fairfield Wednesday evening in a car parked in the backyard of a house. Now on to the state of history. Thank you, Trinity. Now for the state of history. In 1994, grunge rock icon Kurt Cobain commits suicide. Now back to the news. Thank you, Destiny. Ten cold vehicles to see at the 2019 Alabama Auto Show this weekend at the BJCC. From Mercedes-Benz to Jeeps. This show has something for everyone. There are several project production vehicles to see before they hit show on the floors. Show hours are Saturday 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Sunday 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Tickets are $8 for adults and children under 14 are free. Now on to sports. Thank you, Anna. And now for sports. JV softball lost a heartbreaker to North Sand Mountain last night by two runs. Varsity softball lost against North Sand Mountain too. Varsity softball will be in action tonight and Saturday in the May Jimson Round Robin Tournament. Baseball lost to Galesville in an area matchup last night and will travel to Eider today. Track results. Hunter Sisk first in the 1600 and 800. Davion Johnson first in the 200 and second in the 100. Jacob Black, second in the 400. Relay, four by 100, second place. Ian Bloodworth, Bloodworth placed second in 100 meter dash. And now back to the news. Thank you. Um, 
Casey, Celine Dion is going on tour for the first time in a decade. Now on to Joke of the Day. Thank you, Anna. Now for Joke of the Day. Okay, Tara, would you like to say your joke first? Sure. Knock, knock. Who's there? Justin. Justin who? Just in time to steal your joke. <laughs> okay, I've got one. Knock, knock. Who's there? Wooden shoe. What? Wooden shoe. Wooden shoe. Wouldn't she like to hear another joke? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, thou off to a special request by Abel Hilliard. Thank you, Jalen. Now for today, we've got a special request for Abel Hilliard. So we're going to start, start off by asking you some questions. Who inspired you to sing? It was a man named Carter A. Slaughter. I've seen him five times. And he's very good. And he was the one that inspired me. And this is what he looks like right here. Um, do you have a favorite song from Elvis? Um, I really like them all. Do you have a favorite movie that has Elvis in it? Uh, the movie is named Charo. It's a western movie. Okay, last question. We would like to know if you would sing us a song. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so me and Tara is going to step out. <clears throat> Are you looking song tonight? Do you miss me tonight? Are you sorry we drifted apart? Does your memory stray to a bright a sunny day when I kissed you and called you sweetheart? Through the chairs and your parlor seem empty and bare. Do you gaze at your doorstep and picture me there? Is your heart filled with pain? Shall I come back again? Tell me, dear, are you lonesome tonight? Thank you, Abel, for being here, being here for an interview. Thank you, Tara and Abel, for that special performance. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Bye. Thank you, Anna. Catherine Lutich reports oh. from Orange Beach, Alabama. Oh, Cut. Oh. Thank you. Action. Thank you, Cheyenne. Police say two men were found shot to death inside a car in Fairfield. Police say Hush. Varsity softball walks again. Logan! I'm not ready. Stop. Go away. Varsity.